say that people who have lost their sense of joy are like withered flowers. I, of course, must continue to blossom for as long as possible. So it falls to you to entertain me with a thrilling conversation. <laughs> <laughs> I like it a lot. The view here is amazing wherever you look, and the weather is quite pleasant. One would be hard-pressed to find a better location for a vacation. I had no idea that you'd purchased such an enormous plot of land. And it's amazing what you've done with the place. You must have put a lot of time and thought into it. Oh, I remember now. Some kind of mystic art from Liyue, was it? However did they do it? Huh. I'd really love to take this teapot apart and learn more about it. Although, I'm not too confident that I'd be able to put it back together correctly afterwards. <laughs> On second thought, forget I said anything. This place is truly fascinating. It seems to be brimming with infinite possibilities. The only downside is how quiet and secluded it is. Uh, don't you ever get lonely living here by yourself? There must be a way you could liven things up a little here. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, yes! How about hosting a ball here? I'm sure Fontaine's social elite would jump at the chance to fraternize with you. <laughs> They'd flock here in droves, and everyone would be singing and dancing to their heart's content. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> I, I see. Uh, then, in that case, let's organize a smaller scale private dance. You don't need to invite throngs of people or put up fancy decorations. We can simply let the world be our stage and dance whenever and wherever the mood takes us. <laughs> well, come on. Don't just stand there. Take some initiative. <laughs> Twould be my pleasure. Um, you do know how to dance, don't you? <laughs> All right, just take my hand. Now, relax your arms a little and uh, stand with your feet uh, shoulder-width apart. Once we start, just follow my lead and you'll be fine. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm the brightest star in all of Fontaine. <laughs> You're in good hands. A chat, you say. Hmm. A simple word, but a fascinating idea. Through the power of words, people who are worlds apart can come to understand one another's innermost thoughts. But conversations can come with a great risk as well. The deeper you let someone in, the more deeply they can wound you. That's why people are just as afraid of intimacy as they are of being alone. Uh, hey! I just gave a very moving speech. Is that all you can say? <sighs> when one is blessed with both beauty and depth as I am, one naturally has many musings on the vicissitudes of life. All the best moments in opera are grounded in real-life observation. I... I didn't mean that. It popped into my head, that's all. People are just as afraid of intimacy as they are of being alone. And I thought, wow, that's a good line. Surely you've had that before, too. You know, where you really want to say something profound that makes everyone go, Wow, that was deep. Good. <laughs> I appreciate your honesty. All it means is that you're well-suited to stand under the spotlight. 
I've played so many solo performances in the past that I've gotten a bit bored of them. Uh, why don't you join me? We can be a protagonist duo and expand our repertoire. Um, hmm. Let me think for a second. What shows are popular right now that have a good role for you? Hmm. Oh, I know! I saw a pretty decent opera the other day. Uh, why don't we practice a few scenes together? Come on, I'll do your makeup. <laughs> we'll make it a dress rehearsal. Are you serious? Uh, surely I can't be the only one. No, 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 no. I bet you just haven't realized how fun it is yet. Why don't you give it a try? Just focus on what your feelings are telling you and try to articulate that in a serious sounding way. Technically, it comes as a kind of performance, but don't let that get to you. There's no pressure. Just say whatever words come into your mind. Hmm, how should I put this? That was pretty good for a beginner. Starting out is always the hardest part. Keep practicing, and before you know it, you'll be able to show all the sides of yourself that no one's ever seen before. <laughs> Just like me. When that time comes, we can rehearse together. Maybe even work on a new script together. A lot of classics were made that way, you know. And doesn't it sound like fun? Hmm. <laughs> <sighs> there are probably as many things that I want to do right now as there are stars in the sky. I think my top priority, though, would be to add some more furnishings to this place. Uh, hey! <laughs> Don't be upset. I never said there was anything wrong with this place as it stands. However... Pretty furnishings are like extra outfits in the wardrobe. You can never have too many of them. <laughs> That's especially true for tea parties. You've got to switch up the furnishings and decorations every now and then to keep things fresh and new. A lot of people might say that it's best to stick to what's tried and tested. But I think it's possible to respect tradition while trying something new at the same time. I'm glad you appreciate my point of view. That tells me that you're an interesting person as well. Anyway, since I brought up the idea of getting some more furnishings, let me provide the funds. <laughs> Don't worry, Sorrentin Don Chavalmaron hasn't approached me about my overspending so far this month, which means I still have plenty of more left in my private reserve. <laughs> Uh, uh, I mean, what choice do I have? <laughs> there are so many lovely and fascinating things in the world. One simply has to have them. <sighs> All right, yes, I should rein in my spending habits a little. Starting from next month. <laughs> well, when it comes to things I'm interested in, I don't mind putting in the time to become the most knowledgeable person in the topic. Anyway, since I brought up the idea of getting some more furnishings, let me provide the funds. <laughs> don't worry, Sir Intendant Chevalmeron hasn't approached me about my overspending so far this month, which means I still have plenty of more left in my private reserve. <laughs> I just mean my savings from my performance fees. I thought I'd mentioned it to you before, no? I've done the occasional paid performance over the past few centuries, and it all added up, so I do have some personal savings. I turned the whole pot over to Sir Intendant Chevalmeron to manage. She's a lot better at investments and trading than me. I shouldn't have to worry about my finances for quite some time. So, even though Sir Intendant Chevalmeron makes a budget for me each month, it doesn't matter if I spend a little extra now and then. 
<sighs> Good night. <sighs> I often find that in the stillness of the night, all my troubles come back to haunt me. <clears throat> you know what? I'm not going to dwell over them anymore. Let's just get some rest. Good morning. <sighs> that came around quickly. <laughs> I must have slept exceptionally well last night. <laughs> Shall we head out and have some fun today? <laughs> Chongyendao Wamu 我不介意多花一点时间来做到世界上最好的程度。总之，天智家具既然是我自己的主意，就由我来承担相应的费用吧。无需担心，海威玛夫人这个月还没有拿出超支单，说明我的小金库运转良好。没，没办法吧，世界